this high Q microrenator, then we uh, demonstrate uh, uh, several uh, nonlinear applications. The first one is the uh, uh, focus home generation. So we use uh, anomalous dispersion uh, waveguide weights and uh, so to pump uh, the uh, just the single waveguide uh, coupled microrenator and back to the home. And so with the theoretical OPO threshold, and so uh, it you can see it's it's a uh, it's inversely proportional to the, the square of the Q factor. So if we have such high Q and also the high uh, uh, nonlinear index uh, for material, so we expect to have very low uh, threshold. And uh, it is true, and uh, we have uh, the measured uh, comb generation threshold for, for example, for Y terahertz ring. So it's uh, it's around 20, it's around 20 uh, micron watt. Watts and uh, so for uh, 90 gigahertz ring and so it's still below y below uh, middle watts and uh, even uh, even below y middle watts we have have very uh, complete for uh, for com I mean for this uh, uh, for this renator and so it's potential for uh, some middle watts solid to micro com operation. So we compare with uh, other nonlinear material platforms. So you can see there's a big, uh, very big uh, improvement, and also the record threshold power for microcom generation. And so overall order of magnitude lower than the record in silicon nitride. And uh, uh, although silicon nitride has a Q factor is ten times uh, there are than in L gas. So we also want to. Uh, Access the current solid tone as in L gas micro renators, but uh, uh, unfortunately uh, for L gas, it have very large thermal refractive coefficient uh, like silicon. So, so for uh, solid tone, the solid tone duration and uh, uh, is very short. So we need to operate at a very low temperature, for example, uh, less than twenty Kelvin. And so, and uh, in this temperature, we can have stable access and uh, for solid tone and uh, the uh, operation power is. Uh, about three to four uh, milliwatts. So there are another way to uh, uh, to have access to the salt tone, and uh, we can use the normal dispersion and uh, to eliminate the thermal effect. And so here we have uh, uh, about wider and for the weights, and so we can access uh, to the dark salt tone and uh, stably at uh, room temperature. And that's a recent uh, results of collaborative uh, Peking University, and uh, so. We demonstrate more locked uh, dark pulse curve micro comb, and also the operation power is still less than y, uh, less than five minutes. I think uh, by optimization or, or by using even better device, we can uh, we can reach the around y uh, minutes uh, operation power for uh, coherent uh, uh, dark sound. So another application is uh, we use this uh, also still the same device. We can use. Uh, we can use it for quantum state generation, for example, based on spontaneous four way mixing uh, 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 principle. And so we can have very high generation rate and also brightness. So the generation rate is meaning is about, uh, about the uh, scale to the cubic of the Q factor. So you can, you can imagine so how we can improve this. Also, uh, the improvement about uh, three other times, I mean, compared to the uh, perverse. Uh, the platform for this uh, application. So, and uh, I would say it's very promising for quantum uh, circuits, the integrated circuits. So, uh, in summary, so we developed the ultra low loss and uh, so the loss less than 0 0.2 dB per centimeter nonlinear L gas peaks uh, based on heterogeneous integration platform and also achieve the low power on chip nonlinear processes around 20 uh, microwatts. It could be uh, 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 could be for a record uh, for some time, I think. And also demonstrated various on-chip uh, ultra-efficient nonlinear processes. And the uh, scalable and complex nonlinear peaks, I think, uh, are within reach based on this platform with very low power budget compatible with the uh, second photonics. Then we may for, we may uh, interested we interested in uh, uh, Integrated, uh, integrated with, uh, for example, with silicon photonics that too can uh, use the uh, uh, major silicon photonic, for example, the uh, modulators and also detectors, even uh, heterogeneous uh, 
integrated lasers and together with uh, uh, nonlinear signal generation engines. So for fully uh, chip sized uh, generation and uh, processing. Uh, I will talk uh, about this on Wednesday. We have some results this part. So 